Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new here. Today I'm sharing my winter decorate with me, lots of cozy neutral winter decor. I'm also sharing a beautiful New Year's tree. I love the way it turned out. I have some new cozy bedding, perfect for winter. This video is packed. If you're new here, hi, my name is Ashley. I share lots of decorating, cooking, and shopping here on my channel. I would love for you to stick around and hit that subscribe button. It's completely free. And if you like these videos, make sure you give it a thumbs up. It helps my channel so much. All right, guys, let's get started. Hey friends, welcome back. So excited. We are doing the black Christmas tree in the bedroom this year. I also put out a ton of decor. We are turning the bathroom into like a winter wonderland spa. I pulled all of the ornaments because we're doing the tree very glam this year. And I want to put this picture out. I have already cleaned everything so it's all ready to go. All we have to do is decorate. We're so lucky because it is such a beautiful sunny day. It has been so cloudy and dark here in Michigan that I was really worried this video was going to be dark but the sun came out just in time. We also have to do, I already decorated the girls' bedrooms. I'll show that in the house tour, but we have to put up these pictures in their bathroom. I clean their bathroom as well. We have some decor pieces. We need to put up a new rug, um, but I wanna hang one picture here and one here. I did already put up their Christmas shower curtains, so we have a few things to do today. Not a lot of time. Christmas is in just a few days. We were sick, so unfortunately this is kind of last minute. I would also like to put the garland up around the stairs because I would like to put a Christmas tree here. This is what I normally put a Christmas tree. I didn't do it last year. My husband was kind of sad about that. So if we have time in this video, I'm also gonna put up all of the um, garland. If not, that will be in the next video. We are starting off in the girls bathroom this is the only room where you're still gonna see some Christmas decor like I mentioned earlier I did film this right before Christmas but because we were so sick I did not get it edited and out in time but I still wanted to include this footage because this picture above and also the Santa art that you are about to see in a moment are both on clearance 75% off. So they are a great deal. This picture right here is only $12 right now and I think I paid like 50 for it. So now is definitely the time to go ahead and grab it. Oh my gosh, YouTube fam, it has been so long. I'm so glad to be back with you guys. It's been over a month. It's just been such a crazy holiday season. We ended up getting so sick in December. I think the last time I was with you guys, I was saying that there was gonna be like 15 Christmas videos and we ended up getting so sick. I did end up filming a couple, which is why you're seeing like this one today. But yeah, I'm just so happy to be back. How was your Christmas? How was New Year's? Is everyone like ready for New Year, New You? I am not even doing a New Year's resolution this year at all because every single time I do, it just ends up not happening. So I'm going to have a word for 2023 um, and that is something that I will stick with. But let me know what you guys are doing for like your New Year's resolutions or are you doing like a word for the year to just kind of set that intention but I'm just really curious to know. Also so excited for Valentine's Day. This is going to be something very very different for my channel. Um, I think it's going to really help with the winter blues. It's just been so dark and depressing here in Michigan so I think this is going to help but that will be starting on my channel this week so don't forget to come back for that. Let me know are you guys decorating for Valentine's Day? Do you already have your decor up? Also if you have any requests for videos also put those in the comment section because I definitely take those into consideration when I'm creating my content. Do you want to see like morning routine, nighttime routine, videos do you like more day in the life do we just want to focus on decorating anything you guys want let me know and I will definitely put those out for you and if I were to make a wish upon a star would it be too much to ask I'll play Moment to laugh. Because I'm falling just 
guys here is the final reveal of the girls bathroom i love all of the touches i feel like it's just enough the countdown to christmas is so cute i love this little flock tree from hobby lobby i love that it lights up because let's be honest with kids a candle is probably not the best option I love the gnomes. These were so cute and the little matching Ray Dunn soap and lotion. I also have the little soap dispensers here. This one is not Ray Dunn, but I thought it was super cute. I like the girls to each have their own towel. And then you have an extra towel here, but everything turned out so cute. I love this Santa picture. I've been wanting this forever and I feel like it was the perfect addition to the bathroom. And then I'm loving how the gnomes tie into the Ray Dunn Be Merry shower curtain. I put some red towels in here for them. And then you have this super cute picture. Everything looks so nice, but it's still super functional. Now let's head into the master bathroom. Let's get that looking all festive. And then we are going to decorate my bedroom. Yes, it's a time of happiness, a time of joy. But now this year is twice as special because I'm hoping for us to fall in love in this winter wandering. Chilling by the fire as I'm trying to get your attention. If you follow me over on Instagram, my handle over there is Ashley J. Aaron. You can find me at Ashley J. Aaron on all socials, but you will know that I took a ton of baths in the month of December while we were sick and you guys were loving the vibe. So I thought I would share a little more in detail in today's video, some of the things that I like to use. This is the Dr. Teal's. I love it in the lavender scent. These are just great to pull out all of the toxins and impurities out of your system. It also just is really soothing and relaxing. I also added in this beautiful new wooden scooper. This is handcrafted and completely unique. I got this on Amazon. I'll also link this down below. It is just so pretty. So I really wanted to up my game when it came to the spa in this bathroom. I ordered all new bath salts and lotions and scrubs. I cannot wait for that to order to come in, but it's definitely going to make taking a bath so much fun. Here is the final reveal of the bathroom, giving all the spa vibes I was looking for. I love the just green trees against the black wall. I think it's so beautiful. We have some fun winter scented soaps. I love all of the natural elements that really bring the outdoors in. Lots of candles because it wouldn't be a spa without candles. I love the way that this tree just lights up. It'll be perfect for when you don't want to turn the lights on for that perfect winter bath. Tons of bath salts, bubble bath, candles. I just love the way that this turned out. So excited to decorate the bedroom now. I feel like this is the perfect spa bathroom and now we are heading into the bedroom. love to refresh your space for each season I was so excited to get some new bedding because I haven't gotten any in a while and I was looking at this faux fur set 
from Amazon and it did not disappoint. I also grabbed these two pillow covers, which are some of the softest I've ever felt. I'll link it down below. I'm going to add in some potted trees to the nightstand and everything just feels so cozy and perfect for those long winter months here in Michigan. And then we are going to wipe down my dresser and I'm adding in this picture from Mapafold. This is not sponsored. They gifted me this, I think like a year or two ago. And I finally got a frame for it. So I'm setting it out because Steven and I just celebrated our 14 year wedding anniversary on December 6th. And I thought it would just be the perfect time to display this. I'm also adding in all these battery operated lights, which you can actually set a timer and they'll come on at the same time every night along with the Christmas tree. It just made it feel so cozy and special. And I just love the way that it turned out. the notification that my vacuum is being delivered oh my gosh I'm so excited because my vacuum died and I cannot wait to show you guys the one that I got it seriously feels like Christmas you guys if you've ever lived without a vacuum it's like living without a washing machine or a dryer I mean, obviously not really, because you really need those things, but a vacuum, we have two puppies. They are supposedly Pomskis, but I don't think that they are, and they're not really puppies anymore. They're a year old because they just turned one in December. So cute, happy birthday to Blue and Cookie. But they have so much hair, you guys, and when we went from fall into, to winter, they had, I mean, I've never seen so much hair in my life. You guys did not warn me that it was going to be this bad. Some of you guys have huskies as well. Oh my gosh, with our allergies, I thought we were gonna die. I tried to use a more affordable vacuum. I truly did, you guys, and it just, they could not keep up. And I had a Dyson V6 before, and that was one of the ones that died and Thank God my husband just went ahead and got this vacuum because I was just being cheap, let's be honest. I just was, I, I just couldn't do it. That was a lot for a vacuum, right? Something that I use two, three times a day, I did not want to spend the money on. But thank God for him because he did and it was so worth it. I've been using this vacuum for a month and when I tell you it's worth every single penny, it's the reason I knew I needed a Dyson. All of the reasons. If you've owned a Dyson, you know that it's hands down like the best vacuum. This new one compared to my old one, the canister is bigger, the battery's bigger, it has the no tangle brush, every single attachment you could ever imagine. I'm gonna link it down below so you can see the exact one that I have in case you are looking to upgrade your Dyson. I love it, I can vacuum every inch of my house and the battery does not die. My V6, I would have to recharge it every single floor I vacuumed. No, I still have like 40 minutes of battery left even when I'm completely done. I empty out the canister before I start vacuuming and even when my house looks completely clean, it will somehow manage to find dirt and hair and dust that I couldn't even see and the canister will be completely filled. It has helped so much with our allergies. Even though we take the dogs to the groomers and get them trimmed and cut and stuff on a regular basis, we truly needed this vacuum. So now I have it all put together. We are going to charge it and then we are heading into the bedroom to start working on our New Year's Eve tree. This Christmas tree was an absolute must because I filmed this so long ago. Obviously it was a few days before Christmas, but you guys, we went on a nine day stretch with absolutely no sun here in Michigan. It has been such a depressing winter. Oh my gosh, I'm so envious of all my Southern friends and content creators who are putting all of the gorgeous, beautiful flowers and things in their homes for Valentine's Day, which that starts tomorrow on my channel, by the way, make sure you come back. But I think I'm gonna be keeping these Christmas trees up way longer than any content creator should because it has just been so dark and depressing here. I also am missing Christmas like crazy. That doesn't usually happen. I'm like a little sad when it comes down, but no, I was like emotional. So I'm thinking I'm going to leave these up and just continue 
um, Valentine's Day with all of the twinkling lights. I also have a Christmas vlog and Christmas home tour that I can combine into one video. So if you're missing Christmas as much as I am, drop a Christmas tree emoji down below in the comments and let me know and I will still post that video for you guys because although it is not really what you should be posting right now for 2023, we are posting what we want when we want because I just want to be more consistent and showing up for you guys. So if that is something that you guys want and are missing as well, let me know and I will make sure that I post that for you as soon as possible. Should old acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should old acquaintance be forgot and days of old lang syne? All right, guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you truly enjoyed it, and I hope I gave you a ton of inspiration for your home in these dark winter months. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, hit that subscribe button, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye, guys.